Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can integrate your monday.com with a Gmail account. So first of all, what we want to do, we want to create an account in monday.com and once we log in, we want to go to the bottom left corner of your screen. Uh, in my case, uh, there should be an avatar, but those are just my initials, MK. We press the left click and we go to integrations. Now, as you can see, we can pick from all those integrations and applications in, uh, uh, in there. So if you want to go with the Gmail, we press on Gmail and also we uh, can search for board and we can or we can start from a scratch. Once we do that, there's a couple of options that you can choose from, uh, like when an email is received, create an item in group, or when a new item is created, send an email to someone, which is quite really, uh, quite really awesome and will save you a lot of time. Uh, this is the first way how you can do it. The second way is through the second window and it's uh, zapier.com. Once you create your account there, as you can see, there's this dashboard and with a couple of options we can choose from. We can go or we will go to the top left corner where is this icon make a zap. We click make a zap and it will redirect us uh, into the, the new website. You can here name your zap, for example, Monday to Gmail and also first one is trigger so uh, what application we want to trigger in our case it's monday.com we press Monday choose an event uh, for example there's a new update update in board new user uh, you have to pick the trigger the trigger points. Let's go new item. Now we press continue. Monday.com, choose account. We continue. You can test your trigger or you don't have to. Uh, it will ask you for API second uh, level of confirmation. When you're choosing the account but it's no problem you'll find it in uh, you'll find it in uh, here in your admin section and then you go to api and you just generate or regenerate the epi token that you will uh, that you will use to join to zapier and now second is the action we want to pick uh, the another way of trigger which is the opposite side of this trigger mechanism we go with gmail choose an event send email create a draft for example and continue now you just uh, choose an account you, uh, in my case it's this one we press continue set up action and here you go it's a basic way how you can send an email so you just set up an action uh, to you want to send the email to uh, copies, hidden copies and all the other stuff. Then you uh, click to continue and you're basically done. So thanks for watching and see you in the next video.